House Music Series. I'm here with Castro. This is the guys from Castro. Okay. Jack is guitars and singer. Eric is bass. Finn is guitars and singer as well. And Brendan is drums. Uh, they're playing the event we're having at Jay Lindenberg uh, with Daniel Hernandez on October 22nd. So if you take a second to get to know the guys a little bit. If you guys are going to a party, a club, or something like that, or even a house party or like a bar, what would be the one song that would be your entrance song? And the song that would like make you like yeah, describe your night on the inside of the bar and the song you like strut out to. Let's go one by one. Uh, my entrance song would be This is How We Do It on Top Jordan. With Watermelon Man by Herbert Hancock and Hunters. I mean, just that intro. So it draws everyone's attention. We, we Are the Champions by Queen. Uh, Peg by Steely Dan. <laughs> <laughs> Party song would be Rock the Casbah. I have to go with Herbie Hancock again with the Rocket. <laughs> Half a Person by the Smiths. Uh, Rosanna by Toto. <laughs> and then the exit would be Sleepwalk by Santos and Johnny. Uh, Gang of Four Damaged Goods <laughs> when I'm going home because it's usually not that pretty. All right. <laughs> I would leave to Reeling in the Ears also by Steven mm -hmm. Dan. Exit song would be Together by Disclosure. Interesting. That's a good exit song. If you had an ideal tour mate, who would you want to go on tour with? Like, say you had to go on an international tour, you're stuck with these guys for a while. So what would, you, what, what would be your choice? I would just want James Hetfield around so he could grunt. Okay. Just a, a cool, nice band. Yeah, really yeah. cool, nice band. <laughs> just really, really, really great band. guys. Just yeah. really great guys. Like, when you're not playing, what makes you just like, boom, that's like what you stick to. Like, uh, a hobby. Well, these guys are going to the gym now. I think that's their yeah, the gym. Oh, the gym together. Yeah, have yeah. A, a beefcake band. So. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, who was the first musician that inspired you to make music? And well, like, if you can remember the first song that made you want to create, like that one song that goes, "I gotta do this." Uh, Keith Moon from The Who, listening to Overture from Tommy, it's like, "Okay, I'm gonna play drums because like this is awesome." And I started playing drums, and then and he's the bassist. I think <laughs> the oh, well, blackout, the black album, which yeah, had the song say, I was like, "Oh, it's a good pun." <laughs> um, <laughs> It was probably uh, these older the older kids came over to my house to play video games and they, they brought the black album and listened to that and I just remember being like, Well is this I mean it's hard I, I, it's horrible now, but it did change the way that I looked at music. I, I had played drums for a while but it made, made me want to start playing guitar. Right on. I think I was just bored in college. Really. <laughs> Both my parents were musicians. Uh, I was inspired by them to be musicians. Uh, How many cities have you guys played in? Uh, if it's only LA, what's your favorite venue? Uh, I really love Echo. Um, one is Lincoln Hall. Another uh, one is a place called, just like in terms of venue and sound quality, it was called King's Tut Wawa House, I think, in Glasgow. I really liked Portland, Oregon. I think that was really fun. Just the city. From Troubadour. Yeah, yeah, oh, Troubadour. Troubadour. Yeah. It's going to be an awesome show. I'm excited to have you. I love your music. So, uh, yeah, 22nd, people. Come on, check them out.